To us, tiny spaces are fascinating. We believe their unique appeal has to do with their proportions. Their size makes them easier to dominate, to turn them into a personal world. The apartment is located at Palermo, a neighborhood of Buenos Aires. The building lies on a 100 meter long cobbled street. It's a peaceful and quiet area in a busy neighborhood. Our clients are two sisters. One of them is a permanent resident and the other tends to travel frequently. It was intended to be home of one, shared if needed, or ready for short time rental if they wanted to. The original unit was too fragmented for its size and had almost no sunlight. In just 42 square meters, we had five different rooms and just two windows. The original unit had a narrow kitchen at its back. Besides it, it was a laundry. In the center of it, with no access to natural light, the living room. Firstly, we unified the kitchen, living room and laundry into a single larger space. To improve natural light, we enlarged uh, the only existing window that was shared by these three rooms and the original bedroom door was repositioned into the corridor for a better functionality and a cleaner look. We wanted to achieve a space that was more comfortable for the day-to-day -day use and with a contemporary look. The entrance of the apartment is directly through the living room. Everything was arranged in a way so that the access door is not faced directly during any activity inside. The living space is organized by a kitchen bench and in front of it, uh, wooden shelves. We place a storage unit from floor to ceiling to take full advantage of the vertical space. And we arrange some shelves for books and records. We also have a folding bed for guests beneath the shelves. In the kitchen area, we thought a small cooktop was a better choice so that more countertop space was available for food preparation. In front of the countertop, we placed a table to be an extension of the cooking area, a place to have breakfast, to eat or even do some work if you need to. Instead of having a splash pack made of quartz, we opted for a very glossy paint. This paint is intended for industrial flooring use, but it's easy to clean up after cooking and is much cheaper. The storage has wavy glass doors that were common on the 70s and bring back some of the original character. We opted for a neutral concrete floor, which is better for cooking and for uh, cleaning up. Doors and driver have custom fretwork instead of handles for a cleaner design. We chose matte glass because of privacy reasons, but at the same time it softened the light that came into the apartment. Our clients participate actively we're making the design process very fluid. They brought a wallpaper for the bedroom and some objects that stand their personality. We kept the original wardrobe. We also added some handles and painted the original doors in white. 
The bedroom has a small balcony that can be accessed through a double glazed metallic door, which is original to the apartment. It has a beautiful sunlight in the morning and nice view to the trees on the street. The bathroom was completely renovated, but keeping its original scheme to avoid plumbing problems. We use Watambu plywood, terrazzo, pink tiles, black fixtures, and a backlit mirror that give sense of bigger space. We place pink tiles in a vertical way to accentuate the height of the bathroom. We choose carefully each material and finish to accomplish simple aesthetic with a sense of warmth. Some materials are shared throughout all of the apartment for a sense of continuity, but each space has its own character and color accent. Even though Buenos Aires is a big city with no space problems, small living is a cultural reality and goes beyond space availability. People want to be closer to the places they like and the people they want to be with. Design can turn small spaces into joyful places. Thanks for watching. To receive updates on our latest episodes, please subscribe and click the notification bell. And if you're an architect or designer with a project we could feature, please share it with us at nevertoosmall.com slash submissions.